It's Kyle and Jackie O here at Kiss. That's the brand new one. What do you mean uh, from Justin Bieber? He's on the phone right now. We all know he's coming to Australia for Bieber Island. Uh, now, Justin, I don't know what they've told you about this, but we have made this island. Well, the island's already there. But, but we're it, turning it into it, Bieber it's Island. It's now Bieber Island. It's going to be huge. Uh, a lot of people, they want to come and see right. you. The phones are being jammed with people wanting tickets. Uh, uh, it must be, must be. Uh, what do you got planned for us? Um, I just, I'm going to come out and enjoy myself, play some songs and, and hang out and take over. And that's pretty much it, man. Hang out with you guys. That's good. I, I saw your new blue Ferrari. Oh God. Is that, what, 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 one, that what is that one? Uh, that's a, that's a Ferrari 458 Italia. Yeah. Um, 458. Yeah. I've favorite. got one of those. Yeah. I've I'm got like, one of those as well, but you've got to. What are you guys doing right now? Are you guys just hanging out in the studio? Yeah. yeah we're in the studio now. What are you doing? I'm, um, I'm on a lake right now. I am just. Taking some time to just relax and a lake? have a few beers and just oh, chilling. That's do you do you throw stones and do what's it called the skimming? What nah. is it? <laughs> no, Jackie. No, no. Where, where, do you, where, where do you think he's what getting stones? Where, where are you getting stones from? You know when you peek the stones and they scoot across the water, stone skipping. You know, I can just imagine him throwing, sitting there throwing with rocks in the water. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't know what that's called. I think it's just called skipping rocks. This is Justin Bieber, not a not a old caveman we're talking to here. <laughs> Justin, obviously. I rocks. Me and my dad used to skip rocks as a kid. Oh, so did you? Yeah. See, you get it. Um, the song, yeah. the song went uh, worldwide number one, and we saw your performance at the VMAs. That was excellent, and that was amazing. And I know you explained the reason why you, you broke down because you said, you know, you just didn't know how people would react. And how, what, what? For sure, what? I was surprised at that. I was surprised that you weren't sure how people were going to react. Uh, so, well, I think that you know, there, I went through a period of just like just. Like I said before in the in the Fallon interview, just trying to figure some stuff out, and um, I finally have, have figured out a, at least enough to be able to come out and and uh, and know what I want to record and know what how I want to be portrayed and stuff. So right. I don't know. I think um, I think I was just nervous about how people were going to respond to that, and I think that you know you're never you're never sure about that. But um, now I think that I just want to. I just want to have fun. I just want to enjoy it. I want to enjoy the moment and enjoy the the time right now. Um, it, it seemed like uh, you yeah, you did go. It. You went through a period of apologizing quite a bit. Was there a, a moment yeah, where you I, I, like I, I I said this in, in an interview recently. I just said I'm, I don't want to keep apologizing. I don't want to make everything about that. You yeah. know. I, although I I do want to say hey guys like. I, I acknowledge it, and I acknowledge that there was a period, but like we all we all go through that period. But if we live in that time and and don't move on from it, that that's that, that's where we're gonna stay. So not me. I don't apologize I don't for anything. I've had a few beers. So I've had a few beers, guys. Don't judge me. Where maybe I'm just talking too uh, no, too no. openly, but I'm no. just. No, it's all good. Not at all, mate. Not at all. I, like, I, I love you every second of the way. I thought you've been. I've always thought you're right. great. I think you're. Uh, I think your songs are brilliant. Now, um, and we're just well, really, really excited that. about you coming out here. So many people are too. I've got every person I've ever met sending me text messages begging me, "What can I do for tickets?" I'm like, "Oh God, here we go." <laughs> They're a hot pumped. property at the moment. Well, well, the thing is, is I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be in the city soon, and I'm gonna be going around the city and just hanging and, and surfing and skating and stuff. So people will be able to see me. Uh, no do, private. do you need, do you need any, um, any, any? Do you want me to get you organize you a car for while you're here? With a what? Do you want me to organize you a car? Like, yeah, I know you like your Ferraris and your supercars. Sure, what, what do you want? Sure, yeah, you tell whatever. me what you want, I'll get it. I mean, I'm, I'm down for whatever. I, I definitely like cars and, and stuff. So I'll, I'll come down there. We can. Do you have? Is there a track down there we can race? Yeah, th you want to race me? I'll race you. Like, yeah, hundred percent. I'll organize a Let's couple of cars. Um, just uh, what do you want? A Ferrari? Yeah, no, yeah. not not in the street though. Not in the street. Oh no, no, no. We've been there, done that. that. I've both we both been in trouble for that. You and I. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, let's just do that in the, let's, let's have a designated area in like a private place, right? So we don't get in trouble. Done deal. Sounds good. I'll organize. Jackie, you won't be coming because you can't I'll just drive. watch. Do you know what I'll do? What? I'll hold the flag and pull it down. Oh, I was hoping for okay. someone younger to do that. <laughs> that sounds good to me. Are you coming out hey, but, are you but, coming, um, you're coming out solo or are you bringing any friends? What's your deal? Um, I'm going to be coming up with uh, just the people in my in my camp, just like my guitar player and, and people that are helping with the movement. But yep. uh, I might bring a friend or, or so, but I, I kind of like distance myself from a lot of friends and I'm kind of like doing a lot of stuff by myself recently, which is kind of awesome. Cause no. you just
you don't figure yourself out unless you take that time to be by yourself. That's you know? true, yeah. When you say that, you mean like single, no relationships at the moment. You're not wanting that? <laughs> uh, I haven't been in a relationship for a while now. I'm, I'm chilling. I'm just hanging out, just being by myself. Mm. I just, Jackie, yeah. you don't, you know, you, I don't, I don't think Jackie realizes, uh, Jackie, Justin, Jackie doesn't realize that when you're young and you're successful, uh, you don't need to have a relationship. Exactly. That just changes it's on the hour. Relationships only just... But, but the thing is, is that I'm a relationship type of guy. I love to be in, in love, and I love um, cuddling. I love all that stuff. But I got my heart broken, so I'm just trying to, like, just let that heal up. Is oh. that – no, I, I don't want to get too personal, but well, there are don't. lots of references. Let's not, let's not even go there. Okay. Let's not go there, guys. <laughs> okay. I, I, the music. Okay, yeah. well, I will don't ask this. Don't open the door Let on me that ask one. this question instead. <laughs> the, are you amazed at how um, – the the fans have picked up on the Selena Gomez uh, graffiti in the video clip. It was seen in the very corner of the screen, right. but they they picked up on it straight away, didn't they? I think that was. I think. What are you What are you talking about? Because I think that might be fake. I think what you're talking about. Oh, it's it? not real. What are you, oh, what are you referring to? Oh, she's in been the clip. Fooled. Yeah, they. That was like a graffitied wall, and and they they noticed there was Selena written on the graffitied wall, but that's fake. I didn't realize that. Nah, what that do you wasn't mean, me that did that. Okay, right. Gotcha. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Um. <laughs> but- Anyway, <laughs> all uh, these bloody fake things—you never know what's that's real. That's the what's thing, fake. right? I know. You must struggle with the real and the fake stuff every day, do you? Well, I mean, I was dead last week. They said that I died, <laughs> and they were saying R.I.P. to me. So there's a lot of things that they say that are fake. Yeah, but Cody Simpson was out here the other day. He's a nice guy. He's still a mate of yours, right? Guys, yeah, Cody is the best man. He's Isn't really he? talented, really lovely kid. Yeah, I love yeah. him. Yeah, good to be around. And his he's sister, his sister's great as well. It's a talented family there. Yeah, and they're always representing for Australia, so yeah. that's always cool. Yeah. Last time we had you out out here in in Australia, uh, your mum rang right in the middle of our interview, and you put her on the air, and, and, and you know, I think that was great. I love a boy that loves his mother. I think it says yeah. a lot about someone. For sure. Well, I mean, me and my mom, my mom spent a lot of time raising me, and my mom and dad split up when, when they were young, so my dad, uh, or my mom, really took that role at a young age, so we got really close. Yeah. yeah. And what did you make of Kanye's announcement running for president at the VMAs? <laughs> <laughs> I think Kanye, that's just Kanye being Kanye. Yeah. I think that he's just creative and says what he feels in the moment. I don't know if what he feels was real, but... um. It's what he felt at the moment, so you got to respect it. Yeah, and and I remember, yeah, you, you're still doing all the work with Calvin Klein as well. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're uh, we're still partnered up with Calvin Klein. They've been great, and um, I'm glad to be a part of that brand. It's been how been many awesome. how, how many Mark free undies Mark. do you get you know, from it, them? It was, it was Mark Wahlberg. It was it was Mark Wahlberg, yeah. and then. And then they had me, so that's that's not a bad person to follow up after. That's oh, awesome. I love Mark. Yeah, he's excellent. Yeah. How many how many free undies do you get from them? Is it never ending? Huh, yeah, yeah. I was saying before they were saying, "Do you wash your underwear?" I was like, "No, I." They give me enough pairs to where I don't have to wash them. Wow. Well, so what do you do? Do you actually chuck it in the bin or? No, it throws them out the window to girls. No, <laughs> yeah. That'd be great. How good would that be? <laughs> No, no, no! I don't throw them out the window. Girl. You should so sell them on eBay. They no, would. No, you would get a need, mozza. <laughs> he doesn't need to sell his undies on eBay. I know he doesn't need to, but they would go for a fortune. Okay, well, when you get here, um, I'll have some cars. We'll have Bieber Island. We'll spend uh, an afternoon at the racetrack. Yeah. Anything else you want to do while we're here? Honestly, I just, I just appreciate you guys supporting me since day one and always having my back, even through the jokes. You guys. I know you guys have to say what you guys say because you guys got to joke around, but um, but you guys have always kept it real with me, so I appreciate that. Oh, Man, no yeah, worries, no. Justin. I, I, we like who we like. We don't uh, we don't pretend to like who we don't like, and uh, it, it is what yeah. it is. And oh, you came out to Hillsong too. Are you gonna are you gonna go Hillsong it again when you're back? Uh, I'll probably I'll probably go say what's up to those guys, but um, the, I don't think there's a conference this time. But but like you said before, I was I was out there. Um, at that conference, it, and it's awesome, man. Just just to be around that environment and be around people who are just spreading love and hope and and uh, whatever you believe in, it's it's up to you. But that's where that's where I found my peace at. So it helps. Well, that's me great. A lot. And and I was reading that you you have granted two hundred and fifty wishes for children for the Make a Wish Foundation. Two hundred and fifty. I think that's the most of any Anyone. celebrity. Yeah. 
I know I you love it. That's yeah. like one of my favorite parts about what I what I get to do is I get to just like hang out with kids and and with kids it's like they don't want anything from me. They don't want to like pull a deal or they're not they're not trying to talk to me about something. They just like just want to have fun and enjoy the moment. And, yeah. and I think uh, I think that's a, a lot of the misconception that they had about Michael Jackson is that they he wanted to be around kids because they were. They were just innocent, and they never wanted anything from him. So I, I get what he's. I don't know if I believe all the stuff that was going on about, about Michael, but that's just my opinion. Yeah, yeah no, right. no, I agree with you. Hey, now, the, before you go, the album uh, now it's out around November thirteen. You can pre-order it right now at justinbieber.com.au, everyone. But what are we? Is it more of the same of what we're hearing from you now? That this is uh, more great things to come. Yeah, man, we're we're putting out a lot of new music. Um, albums coming out in another month or so, a couple months. And uh, actually, I don't know the exact date. They're gonna kill me. But um, <laughs> but no, we're we've been working really hard. We, we've been collaborating with Skrillex and Diplo. And yes, no, they're excellent. Name. I love that stuff. And a lot of awesome people, man. So so the album's gonna be really cool, really fun, and uplifting. And the, I, I I don't think I can I can say the album title, but it's. It's all positive, and and I, I just wanted to do something to, to be able to have people just forget about all their problems, and when they listen to the music, it's just freeing, and 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 that's what's awesome about music is you can speak any language, but you feel the music in your soul, and and I'm I'm just really excited that all these everybody is supporting me and and loving the music, and um, I think it, it just when you spread hope and spread love, and and you're in a, in such an awesome place that that it it people can feel that and feel the authenticity. So I'm just really excited about that and excited to come back to Australia, man. Australia is one of my favorite places. Oh, mate, we love you out here. Now, there's a lot of people that our phones are melting down every day when we're giving these tickets away. Do you want to say anything to people that aren't going to be lucky enough to win tickets? For sure. If you're not lucky enough to get tickets, uh, I will be acting wild in a in a good way and i'll be out hanging out in the city so you you'll be able to come find me somewhere doing something skateboarding yeah, yeah, around yeah, the city or something keep an eye out for it now uh, this is what i'm going to bring you uh, ferrari versus maserati that's you and i uh on the racetrack i'll organize okay. it okay okay which one do you want all right ferrari. organize it up and we'll have some fun let's be safe though uh, oh of course it's all safe <laughs> all right Okay, we'll see you when you get here, Bieber. On the air this morning, you kiss. See you, buddy. Thanks, Justin. All right, thank you guys for having Bye, me. Man. We'll talk to you soon. I'll see you when I, when I get there. The Kyle and Jackie O Show. Kyle and Jackie O.